maybe look at starting getting solitary done after these guys build it, because we can build solitary up here. Because that's probably what I'm going to build straight away. So these guys, they're looking to... Oh, yeah, yeah, they're looking to get in there, but they don't have um, doors. So I need to put doors here and there. And um, then I can get rid of... Uh, we can dismantle you and dismantle you and I want to get actual walls here and here because now when I go deployment this is separate to this so this area here um, when we get this so I want this as shared I want all this area as minimum security and then I want all this as medium and yep 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 so now we've got a proper separation in between the prison of who is on what side that's the main key that I wanted to get sorted because and then you know hopefully when one of these guys if they piss someone off or like the guards will do something bad then they can be moved on to one other side because let's say that they have done too many attacks or yada 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 um then they can get put onto the other side the other thing i need to do though is go rooms and get yard sorted so we're going to label everything as yard now so it just makes it a hell of a lot easier a bit later on when it comes to marking everything out so all this is technically yard then all of that is yard then all of up to there is yard going to take it a while to do that and you probably will have to bear with the whole scratching noise that it likes making but then we can go like across here and then it just allows them to have access to walk anywhere in the area that I'm giving them and then we can build over the top of it when needed. So now they can walk anywhere in this area as I've listed them to be able to do. Then um, we will need to give these guys a yard as well, won't we? So I can see the problem is then I will list everything on the inside as yard. That's our problem. That's why we can't hold it all the way down and just list it everything is yard because it will do that and that's the big thing that I don't want because it means then I'll have to go back through all the cells and change it and I'll say it's no longer a cell or a shower or whatever and then we've got a whole nother kerfuffle on our hands so I'm going to do all of this as much as I can We do that. Then we've got a list line of two. Why is the yard flashing? If I hit play, is it okay? Yeah, now now it's working. It's just it just wasn't listing itself as yard. So then here, I literally can just go from there to here as yard. And just giving these guys more and more room, practically. And then eventually, we can hopefully make it so it's all nice and green, and we have, like, proper pathways listing everything. And, um, it should look good when we do that, actually. Just ignore the massive scratch pad at the moment, it'll eventually be over. <laughs> and 
And there, that should be the last one. And all that should be one big yard, shouldn't it? There we go. So that's one big massive yard like the others. So then it gives them all the area that they can to walk around and that, because that's what, literally potentially what it practically is going to become, is that the area in between is all their yard. Now that we've separated it all, uh, let's look at our uh, bureaucracy again, because we've got these guys. Uh, I think the next thing is, I think I want to go cat dogs. And, uh, let's go surveillance. Let's just go surveillance for now. Because what we're going to have is that this is a staff room. And then we're going to have kennels kind of like spread out like in here and over here. And then we need a security room and we need a armory as well. So this area is not going to be much armory. There's really going to be none at all. Um, we're probably only going to have... I say in between five to ten uh, armed guards, because eventually I wouldn't mind this whole area having about, I'd say about fifty guards. Every area that we set up should have about fifty normal guards, and I say about ten. This one should have ten canine units and ten armored guards. Then, and the armored guards will be mainly on this side. They'll probably have maybe two on this side, eight on this side. Again, canine units will be two, and I'll just, I'll just give them like a big patrol that they can go around. It'll be just mainly around the cells and stuff like that. Um, because the cells are going to last up to here, and then I think it's going to break into like, um, maybe some more cells up to here, and then it goes into like classrooms and reform programs and all that sort of stuff. So. When we go here, I'm going to go rooms. I'm going to turn this into security. And I'm going to turn this into armory. Then I will turn this into a kennel. And then we'll build the other kennels as well. We could even have kennels up here. And um, just more areas just so the dogs can relax practically. Like We'll see how many we can get in. Uh, so if we go here, it should be looking pretty good. Um, these areas kind of have shared, but they're supposed to be like um, separate. So yeah, that's blue and all that sort of stuff. And yeah, so the prison looks pretty well separated at the moment. It's um, I'm happy with how it's looking. Uh, but we can get some more prisoners. Like we've only got 28. Did that number just go down? <laughs> I think it did. Three dead, eight dead bodies. Whoa, 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 hold on. Eight dead bodies. What the hell just happened? He was a snitch. But, but I'm confused. <laughs> what? Are these are the guys that are... Maybe they're starving from... I need to look at my policies. Hold on. Maybe it's... Yeah, he was the one... Yeah, he was the one that was in lockdown. All the ones... If you look at the ones that have cuffs on them... You have dead, 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 dead. Yeah, a lot of... None of the normal ones. It's all the... Other guys. So this guy's like unconscious. So this guy's about to die. So we're going to have some more deaths, actually. We're going to be in a bit of trouble here. And I think it, it has somewhere to do with the solitary and... See, we have, like, no... None of that in here, which is really good, actually. A regime policy. They're not even in... Maybe it's because since they're in... Like, how it's... like You know how it says, like, 17 awaiting solitary confinement. Maybe it's because they put it in a, it puts them in a permanent lockdown so it doesn't use their cell as solitary. To require medical attention. It's just like, yeah, like Like yeah, we we just had eight prisoners just die, just like that. So if we go here and we go validation. Uh deaths in the past 
safety and security. These, but that's different sort of deaths. Really, really weird. To require, see, like, yeah, we need to get some more prisoners. So, how many can I take of normal? I can take uh, 4, 8, 12, 16. And how many of these guys I can take? I can take um, 16, 32, 40. Okay, so we've got enough for them. And we've only got 21. So, yeah, I'm going to open up that. And we're going to get 8 new prisoners straight in. So, we've got 5 bodies. So that's just going to replace the 5 that just died. Which is okay. I'm okay with that. Yeah, but look at that. That's insane. Just the dead bodies that just happened. Wait, wait, wait. Pause, 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 pause. You jerk. I said pause. I want to have a look at the bodies. I want to see who all they were. Because I think you had like six on you, didn't you? No, you had four. So, Rick Harris. Um... BCL poaching, character, experience. So, condition, none, then he was hurt, KO'd, then suppressed. His whole nine days in, in your prison. He lasted nine days and died. Uh, grading. So, they're given the punishment and security pretty well, which is actually really surprising. But yeah, these are the guys that like spent their whole time in lockdown. So yeah, like they had, yeah, I don't know. It's interesting. I think we need to sort out the solitary because I think that's what's causing a bit of an issue. So we're going to start building that now. I don't know how I want to build it though. So let's look at it. Uh, let's start planning it, shall we? So say if we plan it, to be the size of this. And it actually goes to that. Then we have that one walkway path that leads around. And maybe I could turn it, like I fl flip the door so it's on that side or something like that. Yeah, it's not supposed to be that thin either. I wanted it, like, there. So then I can eliminate this inside wall. And then how many cells can I fit in here? Because we need to... Like, they're going to be in lockdown, but they still need to have a bed and toilet and stuff like that. So... You have... One, two... Three... And then it needs to be that. So you can have that, and then this is the walkway. So then how many of those cells can I get in? So there, there. So how many solitary cells can I get? It's kind of not what I want. It's kind of, it's much bigger solitary than what we had last time. But I think it's something that we need to do because they can't just sit in a one by one area, otherwise they're just gonna die. It's kind of similar to what's happened before. Um, so how many of these can we get is my big question. So if we close this off, and then that, so then, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's mark you. That's nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So we could actually separate it from here. So make it 20. So then it's actually separate from that. And then we could actually, uh, hold on. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that because then we can have something like this. So 
If we do like this, here, here. So then all of them have their doorways. And then down here, so then maybe the entrance isn't down here at all. I need to make a way, a walkway though, like a proper way of transferring from one side to the other. Which isn't going to be here, it's going to be somewhere over here most likely. Out near solitary would be most likely. Then say if we got rid of that, and then that's the wall. So then it's not connected to anything. Then we can have... Yeah, then this pathway could lead to something if we need to. Like, we could buy more land here. And we could have a huge amount of other stuff out that way if we need to be. Um, so, yeah, let's let's build that. We're going to build that. I'm happy to do that. Because we need to get solitary sorted. So, let's go here. Uh, where am I looking for? I want concrete. And then we want to mirror that whole thing. Uh, then, yeah, then we need to find middle ground. So it's, what, 61 in total? So then let's go planning. Let's go pathway. And let's go 30 down. It's actually right where that, six, that one is. So that's where our door is going to be, which is right here. So we can go room or objects. We can go staff room door right here. So then we can go planning. And let's get pathways up again. And let's clear all this again. So we had eight prisoners come in before. We, have we not had those prisoners come in yet? No, because I hit play. I didn't hit fast forward, did I? So we can get those prisoners coming in. They're going to be here in two hours or so. Still waiting funds on that. Let's hit uh, bureaucracy again. I want to start getting... We've get, gotten dogs. We're going to hit bank loan next. That's going to take 12 hours. Um, we've also now unlocked emergency. So we can call in fire, reinforcements, paramedics, stuff like that. I've just noticed the time. And we're getting close to the end of this episode, actually. I can't believe it's actually gone that quickly. I don't feel like we've achieved too much. Although we've got this set up. But since... Oh, that's weird. Why does it flood out like that? Is it be, why, does it not, why does it not flood out in the other ones? Uh, it's because I've probably got it... Like that extra nib wall stops it, I guess. So maybe I should put more... Um, drains like here or something just to stop that. But, um... Oh, I think that whole room just got built, didn't it? Yep, that whole thing got built. So, and that should all have power as well, because the power runs down here. So that's actually pretty good. So then we can get all these walls built. Okay, we just got eight new prisoners, but it's going to give us 30 new prisoners, which we cannot take. Uh, so we're going to have to stop that, because we cannot take 30 prisoners. Not just yet, anyway. Um, we actually... Oh, wait, could we? We wanted to give us 30. Yeah, we could actually take 30 prisoners. We might actually do that, actually. But we don't have the room for them on this side, do we? Because what we've got... How much do we have? We have 24. So we have uh, 16... Uh, 30... 36... And 52 or something like that. So... That's going to get... Yeah, it's going to give us two overflow. That's okay, actually. Yep, we, we can do that. We can take them think. <laughs> we'll see anyway. We'll build some more anyway. Um, but we're getting close to the end of this episode. So what I want to achieve next episode is that um, I want to get the next two rows of this done. We need to get this guy expanded out to here. We need to get the solitary on both these sides done. And then we should be okay. I think we'll be okay. Uh, we had a lot of deaths before. But I think we're getting past that point because, yeah, we got this guy who's unconscious. We probably should get a doctor to go heal that guy. Sorry, ass. Let's grab one of you and get you to go over there now. Let's just see if this guy goes over there. 
And he's like, yeah, I, oh, yeah, I just saw a flash on the screen then a second ago. Are they fighting... Ah, over here, so unconscious. So this guy was trying to do something cheeky whilst visiting his family, which is interesting. <laughs> and he just got knocked out and see... Where does he take him? He takes him straight to his cell when they're unconscious. See, that's what I'm thinking is that since the solitary will be closer to these guys, because these when they're in solitary they'll be they'll be hurt, so um, they'll be closer for them to have access. But um, yeah, I'm looking at the time and we're definitely running over, so I'm gonna call the episode it here, guys. Uh, so yeah, next episode we'll try and get a few more of these cells sorted in the solitary and hopefully get this whole prison finally in its shape that it should be and also start getting the security knocked down. So as usual, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have an awesome day and I'll see you all in the next one. Catch you later, guys.